Hello again, it's Keith James with 96.1 in the Mornings and your host for How to Solve a Rubik's Cube in under two minutes. Last time we made something called the daisy there. We found the yellow center and put the four white edge pieces around it, making it look like a flower. Today we're going to pick up where we left off uh, from there and make a white cross. So we're going to take this yellow center and make it white. Now it's a piece of cake, so here I'm going to show you how to do that. You could very easily take each petal, each side, and move it from the top to the bottom, because that's where the white center is. It's not here, it's here. So we have to take each white petal and turn the side 180 degrees till it's down. See that? See how we're now at the, at the white bottom? So I could take each one of those, just like that, and do it. And this one down, and then the last one down, and if you look, boom, there's your white cross. But we have a problem. If you look closely at each white cross, on the other side of the edge, we have another color. See, there's your petal, and there's another color. There's your petal, and there's another color. These have to match each centerpiece of each side. And right now, they don't. This is green matched with orange. This one's orange matched with green. It's all messed up. So I'm going to move them back to the daisy. So we got the daisy once again. And if you would like to match them, it's a piece of cake. So here we have the green edge, and we're looking to find the green center. And here it is right there. So I'm going to move the top till that edge matches the center. See, there we go. Two greens. That's perfect. So now we can take that one and move it straight down to the bottom and boom, we got a white petal with a white center, or a white edge rather, and it matches the green center. So I'm going to do that very quickly. This is orange to red. That doesn't work, so I'm going to move it to the orange, which is over here. There we go. So white with two oranges. Flip it down. And here's blue. It needs to match the blue center. There we go. And then flip it down 180 degrees. There's the red one, got to find the red center, there it is, flip it down, 180 degrees, just like that, and boom, we have a white cross, plus every single edge matches the center, just like that. So now we have to have the white cross, and it has to match each center. This is the second step in solving for this entire layer, next time we're going to cover the corners. We're going to make the white corners happen, then we're going to have an entire layer done. So thanks for hanging out. I'm Keith James. We're going to get get uh, that whole top layer solved next time. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, our YouTube channel below, so you don't miss the next episode. So I'm Keith James from 961 and How to Solve a Rubik's Cube in under two minutes. I'll see you later.